Transistors Ordinary transistors 1. Description A transistor contains three layers consisting of a p-type semiconductor sandwiched between two n-type semiconductors or an n-type semiconductor sandwiched between two p-type semiconductors. An electrode is attached to each substrate layer B base E emitter and C collector. Ordinary transistors come in two varieties, NPN and PNP, depending on how the semiconductors are arranged. A transistor performs the following functions, amplification switching. 2. Basic operation in an NPN transistor, when current IB flows from B to E, current IC flows from C to E in a PNP transistor, when current IB flows from E, emitter, to B, base. Current IC flows from E to C. The current IB is called the base current, and current IC is called the collector current. Therefore the current IC will not flow unless the current IB flows. 3. Characteristics in an ordinary transistor, the collector current IC, and the base current IB, have the relationship shown in the diagram. Ordinary transistors have two basic functions or uses. As shown in the graph on the left, portion A can be used as a signal amplifier and portion B can be used as a switch. Four signal amplification in range A of the graph. The collector current is 10 to 1,000 times the base current. Thus, the signal that the input signal is enlarged is output from the output terminal when the electrical signal B base of the transistor is applied as the input. 5. Switching function in a transistor, the collector current IC, will not flow unless the base current IB, flows. Therefore, the collector current can be turned on and off by turning the base current IB, on and off. This characteristic of a transistor can be utilized as a relay switch. 6. Application example transistors are used in numerous circuits. There is no functional difference between NPN and PNP transistors. 